Hi, I am Peter Rickson. So here we are at Como Metropolitan London. The iconic design hotel has gone through a refurbishing design process and it looks like brand new again. They offer experiences for the curious traveler with a passion for a life lived fully. Let's meet communication manager Kate Richards and hear about how they have created an urban century for the global traveler. Kate, uh, if you were to explain for somebody that's never been to this hotel, what would you say? I personally describe the hotel as an urban sanctuary. I don't think that you can beat our location in London. Uh, we have fabulous views of Hyde Park, the proximity to the shopping districts of Knightsbridge, Mayfair, Bond Street. But when you step inside the hotel, you feel like you're taken away from the busy park lane road that we look over. You are cocooned then in such a warm, calm environment. The Metropolitan is an iconic design hotel. Mm -hmm. It's been around for some years. Yes. How do you refurbish an icon? Good question. Um, I think when the hotel opened 20 years ago, we were absolutely the first design and first contemporary hotel on Park Lane. We're in between the Dorchester and the Four Seasons, who are iconically British and traditional. So the hotel really kind of popped as something London hadn't seen before, which is testament to our owner, Mrs Ong. Um, and that stood the test of time and was incredibly popular as this hedonistic hotel with the Met Bar being the success it was. Um, but we've seen our guest expectations evolve. We've seen what people are looking for, that we made sure we kept what our guests loved about the Metropolitan before, but just enhanced the product. And so hopefully it works. We've had incredible feedback. Um, the guests understand and enjoy the product. Um, and I think naturally when you do step in to the hotel right from the lobby, you all of a sudden do just have a feeling of what this hotel is about. You have a feeling of wellness, you have a feeling of calm from the infused invigorate scent that we have, the way that our staff treat our guests. Uh, and we're here with uh, Corina Jap, uh, the spa manager. Corina, let me ask you, why is a spa such an important part of the Metropolitan experience? So, um, one of the things we say actually is not just the spa. Um, we have Como Shambhala, which has our whole wellness philosophy, um, the brand which is all about healthy living. And it includes the spa, but it also includes healthy eating, it includes mindfulness, um, which we bring in yoga, um, and it also brings in sort of good physical exercise. Um, so here at Como in Como Metropolitan London, the spa is just one aspect of the whole wellness experience. And I like to call Como Shambhala a wellness and travel brand. The hotel industry has changed over the last couple of years. It's a big polarization. Do you see that as well? Hotels are now not just somewhere to go and sleep, eat, drink. You can have an exercise class somewhere, you can have a cooking class somewhere. There are incredibly creative things happening all over the place. But I think what's important is knowing your market, understanding your guest, and understanding your core principles and sticking to those so you stand the test of time. What do you find is the core of the Metropolitan and the core of great hotels? Well, the core of our hotel um, is our kind of five pillars. So we have cuisine, wellness, technology, design, and our location. So if you look at cuisine, we were the first Nobu in Europe. So 
our owner, Mrs Ong, an incredible innovator to think of bringing that over um, and testament to her that she saw that vision. The same with the design being, you know, we were the first contemporary product on Park Lane, something people hadn't seen before and we've continued to play and be a leader in that space looking at our new design and really I think with the new design especially we've taken on board what's important to us with our location so the views of Hyde Park that are opposite us we've brought them into the room they're such a big part and they play such a big part of the guest experience when they stay with us when you walk in you have this flood of natural daylight, you have the beautiful views of the floor of Hyde Park and we've used that then to emphasise the design with the colour scheme, with the woods that are used. So you have a very natural experience when you walk around the hotel from the front desk and the stone that's been used um, to the, the woods, to the colours, the palettes um, and I think that then really emphasises um, longevity in the product of the hotel. So, Kate, uh, if you were to give a young person that wants to work in this hotel industry an advice, what would that be? Don't be afraid of long hours and learn as much as possible about every department in the hotel.